everyone. Today we are going to make an umbrella with you. But before starting, I want to ask a question to you. Do you know importance of the rain? A large part of the world is covered with water. These waters evaporate every day. With evaporation, water follows a path to the sky. Water vapor falls down to the ground due to gravity. And rain makes water cycle happen. Also, it meets with the trees in the forest. We learned something about rain. So, if you are ready, we can start designing our umbrella. Before starting, there are two rules that I have to apply. First of all, I have to tidy my hair up. After that, I have to put my goggles on. Now, we are ready to start. As you see, all the materials that we need for this model are available in our kit. For this model, we need a wooden cylinder, pom-pom, colorful cardboard, a guide and skewers. Now, if you are ready, we can start shaping our umbrella. Before starting, I want to show the difference between two sides of cylinder. As you see, one of the sides has a circle and the other one has a square on it. While putting the cylinder onto the lathe, the side which has square will fit on that point and the other side will fit on that point. After placing the cylinder, you can lock it by turning lace arm on clockwise. To unlock the cylinder, you should turn lace arm on counterclockwise. When you unlock the cylinder, you can take it out easily. As you see, there is an arrow on the shaper pen. This arrow should always point up. Shaper pen should be perpendicular to the metal part. While shaping, movements should be short. We will touch and pull back, touch and pull back. We will shape our cylinder with these movements. If you are ready, we can start designing our model. Before shaping, we should draw reference lines for ourselves to understand how we will shape our cylinder. I'm drawing my reference lines at the end of the curve and beginning of the next curve. If you are ready, we can start now. At the end of the shaping process, you will see little particles on the surface. We will clean these particles with sandpaper. At the end of the cleaning particles, as you see, our surface is more smooth. Now we can take it out. Now it's time to compare our cylinder shape with the guides. As you see, it looks nice. It's time to clean our lathe. We will use vacuum cleaner for cleaning. After shaping process, now it's time to put our parts together. First of all, we should fold our colorful cardboard three times. It 
it will be like this. After folding our cardboard, now we will use a little bit hot glue to stick our handle and umbrella piece together. As you see, our umbrella needs support and we will support it with skewers. Our umbrella body is ready, but we need a pom-pom to put it top of an umbrella. Finally, our umbrella has done. Today, we made an umbrella together. Maybe you can share your umbrella with someone. See you soon!